Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to kick Gabriel's ass. Hello everyone, my name is Tom, welcome back to another video here for episode 6 of Miraculous Rise of the Sphinx. If you haven't watched the previous episode, make sure to check those one out before you see this one, I have a playlist for that. Last episode, spoiler alert, we defeated Mayura and it seems that we are about to defeat Gabriel, or at least try to defeat Gabriel. But first, we're gonna check on Master Fu for guidance, alright? So we're gonna do that, we're already here, hello. Do, it's a relief to see you that you're safe i just heard the news this is terrible actually i was visiting thinking you could help me there's always a way marionette and lose hope we could benefit from learning more about this new enemy i saw on the tv that the center monster laid eggs during its molting process i believe we have to destroy those eggs i need you to go out there and bring back free larvae by studying their behavior it might give an insight of what they're made of okay so marionette's gonna count to three once again okay so one one Okay, two more. Why do you have to narrate everything you say? Okay, so I, I didn't even see. Okay, two. Okay, one more. A very interesting chatting. And three. Can you say three? Eh. A while later. I'm done running tests on the three beta carapils you brought me early. It appears they feed on human emotional states, and sadly, there's only one type of food they seem to be partial to negative emotion. So I need to smile for the rest of the episode. <laughs> The center monster may convey doubt and confusion into your heart and you may find yourself unable to judge things clearly. If it should happen, you must hold on to something that truly makes you happy. A memory, a thought, an image, anything. Let me know if you want me to work on your power-ups. Yes, please. I'm gonna need a lot of them. Okay, Ladybug, we need to increase Ladybug's damage. And Dexterity, I think it's also really important. How about Cat Noir? Uh, okay, I think it's okay in terms of damage, isn't it? Gonna improve the dexterity and okay, that's pretty much it. Okay, not many upgrades because now they are really, really expensive. Actually, I'm gonna spend the macarons at the Kwame shop at the end of this episode because it might be the last one unless I made an extra one exploring, you know, parts which I didn't explore due to the lack of abilities. This may be your last fight, are you sure already? I'm ready, I'm ready, let's finish once it's for all. This is the spirit I'm rooting for you. Okay, so can I go now? Okay, here we go. Be positive. Of course, that uh, Chloe. Try to think something positive about Chloe. I know it's difficult. <laughs> so okay, here we go. So this is the starting point. Can I jump into that hole? Okay, never mind. Okay, we can do something as Cat Noir. Why does he has to press the button like that? Just use your hands. So is it worth now to collect orbs? Because this is most likely to be the last level. Now, in terms of macarons, I'm gonna collect as many as I can because I'm gonna make a lot of purchases after this episode. Ooh, okay. Nice move. Look at the cars, you know, just hanging in there. Wait. Nice animation. Pixar, your days are over. Yo, look at Cat Noir's speed! Wow! Yeah, yeah. That was so easy. Yep, I'm definitely feeling the upgrades. Like, I've been here for two minutes and I already collected 58 orbs. Oh, okay, we need to go into that hole. This doesn't sound good, but trust me, is what we have to do. Oh, or maybe not. Wait, wait, wait. So, what's that? Oh, okay. <laughs> I saw they were pointing. Uh, but it's not always pointing forward. Okay, it's a question of perspective. You get it. <laughs> the traffic lights are work. H how is it working? Yep, I'm already taking damage as Ladybug. What the hell? Yeah, this map is boring AF, I can tell you that. The map from last episode was way, way more interesting. Just, you know, I'm just going on a straight line. 
Okay, let me just... Yo, I didn't take damage as Ladybug. Big W. Okay, just push this. What did I do? Oh, I think I have to climb that. I think that's what I am supposed to do. And where am I? Oh, okay. I need. This is how my dreams look like. What a stupid place to put a tree. What the fuck is that? Run away, run away. Eee! What the hell was this sound? Yay! It's in the game. Untouchable. These enemies can take any blow, and you have to find a way to stun them. So teach me, master. Maybe I need to. So how am I supposed to do? Oh, now he doesn't. Okay. Um, that seems unfair. Oh wait, he's dizzy now for some reason. Don't make me laugh. Okay, I don't. Not entirely sure what I did, but I did something. Okay, so we're in the phase of finding a lot of macarons. There are times in these levels where you just find a lot of them really close together. It seems like they run out of ideas to hide them. Bro, you're putting me in a fight with these NPCs when a tree is blocking my view. Actually, it's not blocking now, okay. Eee. Wait, 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 this guy is invisible. Let me just take care of that first. Don't make me laugh. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. This is it. I think. <gasps> oh, no. It started its morphing phase. Let's get up there. Hopefully oh, the cutscene is lagging. I can't believe this. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. We need to keep going. Why should I go here? Hey! I'm getting wrecked. Oh. Hey! Hey! Okay, things are starting to get spicy. I'm losing a lot of lives. A lot of hearts, I should say. Let me just check this part. Can I? Oh, I'm climbing the Eiffel Tower. Oh, that's the intended way. Okay. Where should I go? Where? Oh, there you go. Okay. I just need to wait for that enemy to get easy. I don't know. From running a lot. But imagine if you fall and you have to climb everything all over again. Okay, Tom. Focus. Exactly. Let's just be patient to the other platform, and there you go. Okay, this is starting to get trickier. You can see. When you get multiple hits, it's kind of satisfying. Pull this. Okay, go to this platform. Exactly, I'm a genius. Macaron, okay, Cat Noir. Okay, I need to break this. Ooh, okay, thank you very much. I'll take that every single day of the week. How about this one? Can I get an orange? 10? Nothing. This final level has been a bit disappointing, you know. It's really boring. 
Not even the fact that I'm climbing the Alpha Tower is making me very excited. Okay, we keep on climbing, keep on climbing. <laughs> the bus stopped flying. <laughs> Why do I find these things funny? Like, I'm 22. <laughs> like, the concept is cool, like, great, we're climbing the Alpha Tower, but it it's boring. And it ruins the entire experience. Uh, it's always important to defeat these ones first. Uh, okay, here you go. Is there something in this house? No, but it's... Okay, I got it, I got it. But wait, I can do something as Ladybug. Ooh, okay, secrets, okay. This I like. No alternative platforming, how do I get there? Oh, okay, there, I didn't see that. Now click this button. Ah, okay. Now it makes sense. Return. Ten macarons. You love to see it. We can return to our journey. Yep, I, 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 I can't see Dick. Oh, I missed that horror. Okay, too bad. Oh, yeah. Okay, now this has some challenge. Actually, okay, this part is good. It has some challenge. Let's ignore the fact that uh, the materials are going through each other. <laughs> oh, where the hell am I? Bro, well, uh, what? Oh, I lost a lot of hearts. Change the ladybug. I lost a lot of heart because I don't know where I was. Alright, let's break this. Okay, we're clear. I'm gonna pull this platform already. Yep, I'm seeing everything. Okay, this looks... We have a lot of work to do here. Now as Ladybug, we're gonna pull this. Yep, just like that. And 10 macarons, yeah, hell yeah. Okay, it seems to be pretty straightforward. We're getting to the end, I believe. At least it looks like. Alright, so you heard Cat Noir, ladies and gentlemen. So, it's time, I think. Okay, that was lagging a little bit. Don't tell me that's what I think it is! Hurry! To the top! Okay, so this is where our battle is gonna be. No sign of the Senta monster. And no sign of Chloe either. This can't be good. This is good! I should praise you. Oh, there you go. Looking majestic as ever. Behold the space. The of your okay, I kind of saw that in the game cover, but it's a sick design. I really like it. The world. Spare us your theatrics, Hawk Moth. Just tell us where Chloe is. Chloe is safe. How heroic of you to worry about her in spite of everything she's done. To oh, the butterfly is heroic. sick. The Sphinx but is sick. Poisonous. Look like it, uh, the galactic textures. I like that. You know we'll beat it like we always do. There seems to be something of a misunderstanding. The Sphinx was not meant for you. It was meant for the people of Paris. See? Soon it will fly over the city and spread its toxic powder, imprisoning every Yo, I wanna have a sniff at that. <laughs> of despair and sorrow forever. No! These people did nothing to you! Actually, there is a way you can avert this crisis, Ladybug and Cat Noir. And that is by handing over your miraculous to me. 
Really? Are you thinking? Ah, okay. All right, here we go. Then my Sphinx will beat the two worthless pawns that you are in one single strike. Checkmate, Lady The caterpillar was easy. <laughs> How about? How about the Sphinx? Whoa, okay. Okay, so first I need to avoid. Oh boy. Okay, I'm trying to understand what I should do. Oh, okay, now, now, now. Damn it, I'm missing everything. Oh, I'm so bad. Pointless for you, I'm avoiding everything. There you go. Okay, first part done. We're gonna finish this round with Cat Noir. Because, you know, I wanna see Adrian kick his dad's ass. Oh, sorry. Okay. Why do I always miss the buttons? There you go. No. Okay, oh, it's done. Is that it? Ladybug, are you all right? I saw you breathing that powder. Say something. Oh. I can't, but I can't. I'm exhausted. Well, I'm gonna have to do this with Cat Noir. Cat Noir is not really showing a lot of facial emotion, you know. His face looks really neutral. Because there's always evil out there that needs to be stopped. And if we don't stop it, who will? I'm not cut out to be a superhero, Cat Noir. The truth is, I just want to be a normal girl. We might as well With a normal life. Give up. <laughs> Sorry. Don't move. You're hey, he's gonna be. What's the point of it all? Are you serious? <laughs> Imagine if she. Nah. This conflict. You have the opportunity to make it stop, Ladybug. Everything could end tonight. If you are miraculous, let me take that burden off of you. See that ladybug? There are thousands in the ah, okay. marching toward the Ivory Putting Master Fu's advice Everyone to plan. Believes in you. They haven't given up on you. And I haven't given up on you. It doesn't matter. I'm afraid Ladybug's already made up her mind. Feels like that I'm watching an episode. Come on, Ladybug! Season 6 soon, hopefully. Let's wrap this up, Cat Noir. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna do it with Cat Noir anyway. I want Adrian to kick Gabriel's ass. You're not up to the mission the miraculous asks of you. Succumb to your despair. So how do I attack? Okay, I got hit. Oh wait! 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 Yes, it's done! That was so easy! What? The final boss was so easy! Okmoth was the weakest of the entire game! Sunglasses? At night? He's already there up there. Cat Noir, do you know what no butterfly in the world can resist? Romantic oh, the what? Yes, but what they like the most is to feast on light. What are you doing? <laughs> I was clicking Y and nothing was happening.
<laughs> Through darkness comes the light. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna. Where are you going with this? Okay, I'm just watching. Just watching. No. I don't know what really to commentate. And there you go. Just let him go. What? Oh, I've missed you, Gabriel. Too bad you're dead now. Wait, did he really on, die? Bug. Let's end this. Here you go, ladies and gentlemen. It's done. Hawkmoth was the easiest of all. That doesn't make any sense. And uh, here we go, this was the name of the last level, Rise of the Sphinx. Don't tell me what to do, Ladybug, shut up! Why is she back? I suppose I owe you the truth, I was the one who arranged the deal you've made with Akmo. Ugh, so embarrassing, well, thanks for nothing. <laughs> this is how Chloe talks. If I were Akmo, if you'd be fired, just shut, shut, Rest assured I didn't want it to go down this way, Chloe. Being a superhero is so overrated anyway. I don't have time for this. Just shut the fuck up. Ladybug treats you as your worthless pawn and fails to see the queen you really are. You shouldn't give up on finding your way. Nah, ridiculous. That's a really ridiculous. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop. I hate Chloe, but I love this type of dialogue. It's really funny. One last thing. Talk to Alia. Okay, we're gonna do that. Did you forget today's Adrian's birthday? Hey, actually, I forgot about that. <laughs> we're Adrian. With everything that's been going on, the school closed, the lockdown, Akmov's attack on Paris. It looks like he's going to spend his birthday alone. You need to do something, Marinette. This is your big ten chance at saving Adrian's birthday. I just want to kiss him. <laughs> You're always here to support me. What do you suggest I should do? Okay, first option. Why not? Max being accumulated again. Chloe being abducted. The whole city in Paris. You'll still find the time to care about me. I know that your feelings for Asia are not just a fake. It feels so good knowing that uh, I have you as my best friend. I mean it. Are you on his way home right now alone? <laughs> That sounds so sus. Go see him now. He must be devastated that the whole Santa Monster thing at his birthday party cancelled. Okay, so we need to find Adrian. What if I change to Adrian? <laughs> Go find Adrian. He must be like that uh, crazy fan. Before finding Adrian, because I think that should be the proper ending, I'm gonna buy some collectibles. So we're gonna spend all of our orbs, because that was the final battle. I think Ladybug lacked a lot in energy and damage there you go we're gonna invest in energy and that's pretty much it so we're going to the kwami shop we have a lot a lot of stuff to unlock and one thing that i really want to unlock is the music so okay so this should be in the format of a cd okay there you go the city of light errands to run we're gonna unlock adrian there you go alia gabriel you know villain always really important Unlock Nino. I really enjoyed the Rocketeer song. No, not Rocketeer, sorry, uh, Soundwave. Okay, it seems that we have some sort of behind the scenes. Like, it was saying making the episode, so maybe I was expecting to see some behind the scenes at the studio or something. Okay, it's basically the game soundtrack. I was really curious to see Nino's songs. We still have plenty, plenty of characters to unlock. I don't know, am I motivated to get 100% on this? Mm. Okay, we're gonna find Adrian as Adrian. <laughs> Arnett, glad to see you're safe and sound. Me, safer and sound, mean sound safe and... <laughs> it seems a lot of people I care 
about have got their feelings hurt lately. First, there's Max, who got acclimatized because he thought he was criticize his game in front of him. Then Chloe, who got manipulated by Okmoth into pulling all those pranks. Chloe is intense, alright, but she can be a real pushover to one who knows her flaws. We all fell for her pranks, but in the end, our feelings were truly hurt, you know? I've been thinking about something. What is it? Ladybug has the powers to fix just about everything when she prevails in a battle, right? She can fix anything material, right? But what if uh, our feelings get hurt in the process? What about Max? He was really hurt back there. As for Chloe, her self confidence must be crushed. You know, Adrian, my friend, time heals. People get better, Adrian. They stumble, they fall, but they always get back on their feet again. You are being very... Very... Oh, no, 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 Marinette. Always. You are being... <laughs> It's good to know that myself and Adrian are on the same page. You almost made me forget that my birthday party has been cancelled. Oh, your birthday, that's right. We can still throw your party, Adrian. It's not too late. I'm afraid it is. I'm expecting a home, Adrian. No, no, no. We'll improvise something out of no and have a sky cream picnic there. Okay, there you go. That was like out of nowhere. I think this episode of Sadness the City went through wasn't totally devoid of interest. For a moment, I wanted something or someone to hold me in their arms and tell me they love me no matter what. What are you insinuating? You think it's what Chloe goes through every day that she lacks affection? Without a doubt. You guys don't know her mother here, right? Thanks for the support anyway. All that matters in the end is that Ladybug and Cat Noir saved the day once again. Jeez, this has a lot of chat. Marinette, it's good to see you, especially after everything that happened back there. Since we're not having your birthday party at your place, maybe you could set something else instead. Me, the others, a nice spark, some nice music, ice cream. Instead of you, but can't. Sorry for being such a downer. It's fine. Not the of the world is Adrian, you're a jackass. There's one last thing I need to do before we can call it a day. As much as she's responsible for all of this, Chloe's been much maligned back. I need to check on her, make sure she's alright. Look to the Le Grand Paris Hotel and make sure Chloe is okay. Chloe, I just wanted to check on you, make sure that everything was okay. Quit the acting like debug. You're almost here to grab me some fame for saving. What the I don't need your validation. What happened yesterday doesn't change a thing. See you around, Chloe. I know that uh, when the time comes, you'll do the right thing. Meanwhile, at the Crest Mansion, Gabe before you say anything, don't Natalie. If that an apology you're willing to express is not necessary, the only reason I wouldn't have approved your plan is that is too dangerous for you to use the damaged peacock Marag. Oh, so it was damaged, but it seems she seems fine. Our next move? You mean you still have plans for Chloe? I wouldn't lay waggers on her just yet, but I understand it would take just a little nudge for her to join our ranks. If we want to involve Chloe again, we shall give her the opportunity she longs for. I suggest we give her some time to ponder before we can make a new approach. Okay, and that thing's where we're gonna wrap up. I don't know if I'm gonna make another episode. Oh, that's right, we can check out new costumes. Oh, there you go. It's this one. Okay, so a nice reward. Oh, Cat Noir looks sick with this one. I really hope you guys enjoy this series. My opinion, this game is very, very mediocre. But deep, deep down, I kinda enjoy it because I'm a huge Miraculous fan. I hope you guys are having a nice day. Enjoy the rest of it. That has been me, Tom. I'll see you guys in a brand new video next time. But for now, take care.